Hello everyone, my name is Parag Paul and today we are going to see the how to analyze the truss. Okay, so for that you have to go to geometry. Okay, run structure wizard in strat uh, in this strat form. Okay, uh, select how truss. There are number of trusses examples or models are here. You have to double click on this. After all, the all dimensions uh, you have to fill here. Uh, I wanted length of the 10 meter uh, sorry 7 meter okay 7 meter length height of none but uh, nothing but one 2 meter uh, width of uh, okay 10 meter and then a number of base along width that meter along z direction okay z direction that particular truss along z direction if it's a nothing to be about uh, minimum um, 10 okay 1 1 meter distance apart yeah or uh, 5 5 okay 5 okay this 6 means the that's number of base number of parts in the truss okay i want 6 okay if you wanted to change the distance between the uh, along this you can change there i want your spacing equals okay so i want the uh, spaces you can uh, give your name uh, give it name here properly and click and apply okay so the truss is to be created here after click on copy copy word yes uh, obviously we such a sort of trust we place at a particular level okay i wanted to place it a 5 meter distance along y direction and upward distance okay so click on okay fill the value 5 and click okay after that you go to the front view you see here the trust has been placed at particular distances okay after that now <coughs> now i wanted to provide here the column member okay like this click double click on double click here and click here okay now see here only the this column is attached to a single one but i wanted to attach this column to each and every one here okay so first of all i wanted to check this distance what is the distance between this i know this two meter distance but if you don't know how the how to calculate this distance select the beam or uh, select the particular column check on this okay dimension and display to the selected pin and display so here 2 meter distance is to be here and after all you can remove simply by simple process okay so now select this make it copy paste beam at z direction at particular 2 meter distance click ok after select this do this process same okay sorry z distance 2 meter distance okay mm, copy paste beam at 2 meter distance copy paste beam at 2 meter distance copy paste beam at 2 meter distance okay now I take all these distance similarly you can do there but one of the simple process also here by checking all the distances here or simply one check this distance 1.17 so 1.17 uh, this total is uh, or you can go for this simply Like that particular we may rotate how to rotate this rotation is very easy like this okay select the beam do the process same. copy paste beam at 2 meter distances okay this these are the rotation and the paste beam these are very important commands because in complicated structure they are very useful okay during selection of beam the all are very important so keep in mind and use it very properly copy and do the distance okay now once again right just click on that rotation command okay after that now this is my total geometry if you wanted to see in 3d rendering go to here we the, we can't see here the 3d model because this is this is what just model wireframe model 
we are because we are not just assign we are just doing 2D model rendering we are not assign any property to this structure now I wanted to provide the property so for that I go to the general go to the property and define some members I assign some profile I want angle profile double angle profile okay and column profile add after I wanted to provide first of all this is the property I take after that I wanted to provide support first of all providing support go to the front page okay create one support I want to provide fix support add select this support select in such a way assign to selected not assign and check all the load and uh, all the support are assigned or not okay after that go to the property angle section I wanted to provide angle section in this member one inner section okay double angle section to the outer section okay and column section to this so first go to the column section okay um, like this okay now this is assigned to this after that hmm, hmm, double angle section okay listen I wanted to provide if I just see okay If I can see here, listen, I wanted to make here also one beam, okay, to maintain the column properly, okay, but uh, now I don't require this, okay, so still I'm not, this is a basic uh, video for the this, uh, analysis that still trust, okay, for that I, this has been an example, in my next video I am telling about detail of the how to design the trust also, so first of all I assign the property, this is the column, then now I here to providing the double angle, so click cursor and select all this outer 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 okay like this and check it out whether all selected or not okay after that here also select double angle section okay similarly click rotation it is very important okay or you just give angle section or pipe section okay you also provide pipe section also i wanted to provide here a pipe section because uh, it's time okay here we go for the pipe section i delete this uh, i don't require this okay i wanted to provide pipe section so go to the section database first okay here go to the indian okay then go to the pipe section here select any pipe view table check it out the area okay i want some pipe uh, you can select very minor pipe 761 okay i want it this i want to provide this so this one is medium and one outer for outermost medium at this one okay so i take all these two this for inner and this for outer so i wanted to provide this first of all select okay like this the outer frame of the truss because in my college the pipe use pipe section used for design the um, trusses okay you can check that okay what i did i just click on click select like this okay very normal so all these beam are selected so this is very basic example whether it is very easy to select all like this okay if you select because inner side of beam if you go to select it so once another another uh, base section also selected so for this, this is very simple like select this okay just click very manually okay and go very smoothly because this is very important first of check all node whether are selected or not if anything is uh, not selected then in your uh, warning the elastic model is, is not given such a command is to be uh, kind of okay so everything is selected right now go to this member and assign to selected beam assign yes okay after that i wanted to provide inside section inside beam so it is very simple just click select 
this assign take more time and load loading can take more time so first of all select the section what you wanted to provide the property okay such a section then select select here assign to select to assign yes now i wanted to provide column okay so i define the command sorry not delete define the command sorry i wanted to word rectangular uh y depth means 0 0.30 by 0.23 okay add close and i wanted to assign this to my call now you can go to the three modeling and watch this okay so you can normally see this this is your trust okay so such a way you can build up your trust as your own by clicking the particular length particular width particular distances okay and particular height so this is very easy to create the model first of all it is very important how to make the model model creation is very important if you got the model then you get the you can properly get the um, imagination to how to make the structure like this okay so model creation is very important after, back, up, after creating the model to design it very simple but model is very symmetric model is always symmetrical about its section okay so there is no any problems uh, problem for occur during the designing now next step is for the design load calculation here okay, load obviously i go for the first definition wind load go to the wind load okay or uh, yeah i go to the wind load first add close here add then i wanted to provide intensity 1.2 at particular height i want particular height this is what is my height distance with 5 so 5 meter distance calculate as per sc um, go to here building structure structure type is my nothing trust tower okay oh uh, yeah so, um, yes height no it trust tower okay so um, not like that i wanted to go this way okay well then it's too much height go to this okay then <laughs> this is a very complete confusion uh, apply okay then add factor one add close and assign to the view okay that is obviously attached uh, assigned to nodes okay after that minimize this go to the load cases go to add go to uh, dead load dead load then go to live load then go to wind load wind load along x positive direction wind load along x negative direction wind load along z positive direction wind load along z negative direction at close okay after that assign you the particular loads go to add self rate obviously then go to the member load add uh, minus of 12 kilonewton along gy direction add okay close then live load add self rate now on the member load minus of 6 6 minus of 2 add close then x direction add go to the wind x plus 1 add okay add wind load x plus 1 add close okay it is already, already assigned x negative select wind plus it is negative so you know minus okay minus 1 add close then z positive go to z in direction z wind up okay then okay plus one okay now time to assign 
dead load self weight assigned to you that means dead load of the all the structure okay after all 12 kN this is for the beams and the selection is very important factor if you very perfect and selection of the trusses then there is a no problem and it is very you have to get more practice to solve the structure like this okay assign it okay now very important that which term are provided it is this one i like minus direction okay okay so this is exactly like this this is important okay now okay after that once again select all these things check it out now assign this okay but these are dead load on local y direction live load along proper z direction proper y y direction okay global y direction i can say will load is already assigned okay With, because of the definition we assign okay we assign the definition and according to definition it is already get assigned now after all you have to analyze the structure analysis is very simple go to analysis and print add close analyze run analysis and shift okay what you want more deflection maximum bending moment okay shear so this thing get calculated in the okay one what is a warning actually uh, to check invisible instability in the joint okay notes very very string weak okay first of all i wanted to check failed beam select by specification all failed beams okay here no failed beam our structure is economical and and uh, what can i it is very economical and uh, first of all always we go for the design we go for the economical section so yes there is no failed beam that means it is so much economical but after design there is some problem has to be created so always make sure that your section is not to fail in the design obviously during um, so during the designing it is obviously very proper and very economical and very stable okay so thank you for watching my tutorial on analysis of the truss in my next uh, video i am telling about how to design how to analyze just this particular truss also okay and this truss same same truss and this how to design this okay in my next video so keep watching keep learning and this video link with the design lectures so thank you Okay bye